these are the different pages in my Power BI desktop report. And in this video, we will try to understand what is a Power BI template. Uh, this is the documentation. And Power BI template files have a .pbit as file extension. And these templates will help jumpstart and also standardize report creation. For example, uh, the use case could be if you're trying to create a standard report uh, layouts for uh, your company, maybe across a division like sales or marketing. So you could use templates. So once you save this report file as a PBIT file, it clears all of your data but keeps your report structure. So uh, importantly, this template file doesn't include any data. So in case if you have any privacy concerns and everything, you don't want the data to be accessed by anyone, you can um, use PBID options so that the users could use their own um, data source and kind of use the same template. So that is the whole idea, right? So it's pretty easy. You Once you create a report, you can go to export and uh, save it as a Power BI template. So in case if you're trying to test it out on your desktop or your PC. Um, it might not work initially because already for the data source, you gave permissions as shown here, data source settings. So you might have to clear permissions to test if this template is working or not. So I, you don't want that to be automatically connected to the data source. So that is one thing which you should keep in mind. We could go to um, Power Query by clicking on uh, transform data and create a new parameter. We will name it as file path parameter. You can add a, a good description so that the user is aware what to do. So for example, we'll say that, hey, please use your file path. And we have to add a file path here. Let me go to my file. I'm using Netflix history. Right click, copy as path, paste it in the current value area. And we'll make sure that we'll remove the codes here and uh, click OK. And you can use all those uh, drop down options too based on your needs. Here uh, we will click OK. The parameter is ready. We'll go to the source of the file and replace this value with the new parameter which we have created. So that way uh, user is prompted when they open this uh, template to enter the file path, their own file path. So that will close and apply and uh, it is, we are ready. We will export this as a, a template. So um, we'll save it here. Couple of options, you can right click on this button and open or double click, open it directly or you can go to Power BI Desktop and import it as a template. So that way you have your template here and uh, user is prompted. For example, once it's uh, there, the file path parameter. So let us test it out. Let us enter our file path parameter and it is working perfectly, right? So th this is how you create a template and uh, share it among your peers. So thanks for watching and uh, see you in the next video.